Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So I got my new Morphe 39S palette and I tried to do a bronzy goddess look. If you want to see how I achieved it, please keep watching. Don't forget to subscribe. I already did my eyebrows and my foundation off camera. Here I'm using the e.l.f. Cosmetics 16 hour camo concealer in Tanzan. I'm using it to conceal um, my eyelids and under my eyes and I'm also using the Tarte Shape Tip Concealer in medium sand I will, so I can brighten up uh, more of my eyes. Whatever is left on the sponge from the concealer, I bring down to my chin. And I like to add more concealer to my nose and to my forehead. Now I'm using the e.l.f. Cosmetics one in the rich chocolate shade to contour my face. I wanted to give the darker shade um, a try because of the heat and I have to work really fast because it does dry faster. I'm using the Luxy um, 680 brush, the Pro Precision Face, and I did not like how it came out, so I went back with the Beauty Blender so I could work faster. To set my face, I'm using the Pretty Booger Matte Powder. I 
I feel like it helps me a lot during summer. My face um, likes to drench in oil and sweat. And this helps my foundation stay in place. I'm using the Dermal Blend um, Illuminating Banana Powder to carve out my face. Here I'm like, oh, that's bien chula. <laughs> no Nomás díganme, ¿quién no se chulea cuando se está maquillando? O cuando se está arreglando ella misma. Si no nos chuleamos nosotros, ¿quién lo va a hacer? I'm also using the Grande Lip Plumper. Yeah, it does think. But... Let's see if it works. I'm using my new baby, the 39S palette from Morphe. I just don't know what look to make. I'm using the shade Super Swanky from the top row. I felt like it was too light to be my transition shade, so I came in with the fame game. I went ahead and dusted off my baking powder. So I don't get that extra white cast on my face. I'm using the Decadent AF.
Here I'm adding the Tarte Shape Tape Concealer to add some halo to my eyes. Your concealer doesn't need to be perfect because you will be blending in the dark shade that you used for the crease. I'm adding that's tempting to the outer corners to darken it up. I'm now applying show off to the center of the lid. I am applying the Fame Game to the bottom eyelid, uh, mixed in with um, That's Tempting. Now I'm using the Liquid Genius um, Liner from Ruby Kisses. This shade is luxurious gold. When you try to do a perfect line but you mess up. Ooh -ooh. I'm applying the Sephora um, waterproof liner in French Rivera. I'll be using my Miss 3D Pure Mink Lashes in style ML543. So for my waterline, I'm using the LA Girl Glide Gel Liner in Berry Black. Now for my inner corner, I am using Catch the Light as a highlight.
Now this is my favorite part. I'm using the Park Avenue Princess by Tarte as my bronzer. Now I'll be using the e.l.f. Fiji Blush Kit. I like to drench my face in the Morphe Spray. I like how my foundation and my powders um, combine together. I'm adding the Estee Lauder Heat Wave Highlight. I feel like this one gives me the buttery, um, silky, smooth highlight instead of a chalky highlight. Now for my lips, I am using the color Auburn from NYX Cosmetics. And I'm going in with Anastasia's Ashton Liquid Lipstick. 